Generative adversarial networks, commonly known as GANs, are a class of artificial intelligence algorithms used in unsupervised machine learning. They involve two neural networks, termed the generator and the discriminator, which are trained simultaneously. The generator learns to create data resembling the training data, while the discriminator evaluates its authenticity. That is, whether each piece of data it reviews is derived from the training data set or generated by the generator. Through this continuous interaction, GANs learn to produce highly realistic and complex data outputs, which can be images, texts, or sounds that are indistinguishable from authentic data. The concept of generative adversarial networks was introduced by Ian Goodfellow and his colleagues at the University of Montreal in 2014. This groundbreaking paper laid the foundation for what would become a significant area of research in artificial intelligence. Initially conceptualized to generate photorealistic images, the framework of GANs has evolved rapidly, incorporating advancements that allow for more stable and diverse outputs. Over the years, researchers have developed various iterations and improvements, such as conditional GANs, which produce outputs based on given conditions, and cycle GANs for image-to-image -image translations without paired examples. These enhancements have broadened the applicability of GANs across different fields, significantly shaping the landscape of generative models in machine learning. In the core concept of generative adversarial networks, the process of data generation involves two main components, the generator and the discriminator. The generator creates new data instances, attempting to mimic the distribution of real data encountered during training. Conversely, the discriminator examines both the real data from the training set and the newly generated data, aiming to discern real from fake. The generator continually refines its output based on feedback from the discriminator, learning to produce more accurate imitations of real data over time. This adversarial process drives both networks towards improving their functions with the generator producing increasingly realistic data and the discriminator becoming better at identifying subtleties that distinguish genuine data from imitations. The key components of generative adversarial networks are the generator and the discriminator. The generator's role is to create new synthetic data that mimics real-world data. It tries to generate data that are convincing enough to be considered real by the discriminator. On the other hand, the discriminator acts as a judge, its primary function is to evaluate whether the data presented to it is genuine from the actual data set or produced by the generator. This evaluation is done by analyzing the data and deciding its authenticity. The effectiveness of a GAN largely depends on the capability of the discriminator to differentiate between real and fake data and the ability of the generator to create data that can fool the discriminator. This interaction encourages both components to continuously improve their methods, leading to the production of increasingly sophisticated and convincing data over time. In discussing generative adversarial networks, several foundational terms are essential. Generator refers to the part of the network that creates new data samples. Discriminator evaluates these samples, distinguishing between genuine and synthesized data. Latent space is a complex data representation space from which the generator constructs new instances. Training data are real-world examples used to train the discriminator and guide the generator. Understanding these terms is crucial for comprehending how GANs operate and their ability to generate convincing synthetic data.